Welcome back to another challenge, warriors. We have only five minutes to create a clock, and that clock should have three different teams that we should be able to choose. Once again, we are starting only with the fresh copy of Next.js, so that one is not included in those five minutes, and you can track my time here in this tab when I press start. And okay, let's relax, prepare, and press the timer now first thing i'm going to do i'm going to my page and i'm going to remove all the unnecessary stuff from next.js like this and i'm going to create a new folder call it components and inside of that folder i'm going to create a clock.tsx which is going to be our clock react component i use the snippets and i'm going to put time here so our time is going to be the state so I'm going to create time and set time and use use state by react and we need to put use client because we are using the use state and for our default value we're going to put new date and then we're going to set uh, to local time, time string like this and we're going to use the nus time zone settings and our 12 we are going to set to true so that's for am pm let's now here just call that component to see if everything is good no what i did i always lose time on things like this okay clock is not defined i just need to import it nice time we just need to put the brackets and there it is time so now we need to call use effect don't lose time anymore on stupid things and here we are going to use set interval and it needs to change our time on each 1000 milliseconds which is one second and we're going to put set time let me close this sidebar this is annoying to me i can imagine how is it annoying to you for you so now here we are setting the time on each second to new time and i'm going to call it timer and just to return the clear interval for that timer so we don't end up in a forever loop so now if i refresh it's refreshing okay it's working nice so now we need our teams i'm going to create an interface props and there i'm going to put a team which is going to be string i don't have time for enums or things like that that now but i'm passing the team and here where is it the div i'm putting the class name let's put a little bit of styling text three excel and rounded and then we are going to put our team string here team nice so now here if we put something like no don't do that what is happening team and now here we put background white and text black it should be yes nice so this is basically our light team so now here i'm going to create the team and set team and that one is also going to be use state from react and we need use client because we are using the use state and our first default value is going to be our light team so here i'm going to put team okay now we need buttons so here i'm going to create three buttons so let's put there also a little bit of some styling and first one is going to be light second one is going to be dark and the third one is going to be neon okay and here i'm going to put class name of flex and gap five so they look nice and here on click i'm going to call the set team and for the light team i'm going to put exactly the same like for the default one background white and text black oh 40 seconds okay so 
this one I'm going to put for the dark that's going to be background black and text white and for the neon where it is it's going to be background slate 800 and text green uh, 300 20 seconds okay so now if I press light dark neon it's working okay just to style it a little bit let's put it here and I'm going to put all these to the buttons like this so oh, no and here it is I'm late like three four seconds and I wanted to put this timer uh, below so I'm resetting uh, okay I mean I'm satisfied it's not like that I didn't do it I just didn't do it on the way I wanted I'm just going to put this one to finish it so uh, I wanted to put everything to wrap up into one flex column like this flex flex column and gap of five and just to put inside this whole thing I needed like 10 more seconds let's say it like that I don't know where I lost my time but oh and here also I need the items center yeah this was the final result that I wanted um, I did it I hope you enjoyed the video warriors it was really fun for me if it was fun for you like the video and join the horde subscribe there is also a discord channel if you have any questions for me or if you want just to chit chat with others about the technologies or whatever you want you have the invitation in the description below. If you want to see my first speed coding challenge, you can check this video here. Until next time, farewell warriors.